Hello people, how are you? This is my first video on this channel. You know, it's a new channel. Just made this. Uh, made this. But anyways, my first video will be how you can use a keyboard and a mouse to play games like Roblox, Minecraft, Fortnite, Fortnite Season 3, because you know Fortnite's banned, and um, much more games like that. So first thing I'll uh, show you is I'll show you proof that I have two Bluetooth devices connected, and that's the keyboard and my uh, mouse, right? But I'm gonna show you guys proof. Like, if you guys don't know, uh, if keyboard and mouse, like, it doesn't work somewhat, somewhat. If for some reason, it does not work. But look, I don't know if you guys can hear it, but I'm literally spinning my keyboard WASD, and it's not working. The only way I can move is by using my mouse and driving. But who you play like that, right? So today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do it. So let's get started. All right, so let's get started. So first thing you guys wanna do is you wanna go into your settings. It's gonna block out my name real quick. Okay. And you wanna go down here to your um accessibility settings. Now you want to go um down here, you wanna go into keyboards, right? Make sure full keyboard access is off or you will not be able to do this tutorial. So go to keyboard, um click keyboards, uh click full keyboard access, turn that off. And now what you guys wanna do is you guys wanna go into switch control, right? Um Make sure switch controls off. Uh, hold up, let me delete these because you know I need to show the video again. But yeah, one second, let me just delete these and I'll show you. So yeah, make sure you guys um is keyboard like. Let me show you. So like, look, if your keyboard was like, if it says f full keyboard access was like literally on, like let's say it was on, right? Uh, look switch control like it, you wouldn't be able to turn that on which you do not want you want to make sure you can turn that on so turn that off because you know the the switch control thing you're gonna need so when you go back to the switch control you want to go into switches right we click add new switch right now you want to click the button external now you want to click w and then you can name it i name it w forward and then after you save it and put it, name it something, right? Click W, um, which is obviously forward, so I named it W forward. And then you want to go down and actions, right? You want to scroll down and find tap. Click that, and there you go. Now you want to click add new switch, and then just add the rest of the switch. So I'm gonna speed up this video so I can do. It. All right, guys, I just finished saving them. So what you guys want to do is you guys want to like come to switch control, go back. Click recipes and now um, you want to click create a new recipe, name it whatever you want. I'm gonna name it Roblox. Uh, my oh my god, dude. Okay, Roblox. Then click assign new switch and then you guys want to assign all your switches. So basically, W forward, right? So basically, when you go W forward, right, you want to click custom gest gesture and then you want to put you want to like put your uh, you want to put your finger like up. Up. Like, I want to do it a little straight, but put it around somewhere uh, here because this is where the touchpad is usually is. So, I'm just gonna put it up. And now, once you do that, uh, you want to do it quick, a little quick. I'll show you how to do it. So, like, just do it, like, do that. Okay, guys, this is present me, and I just want to tell you guys make sure you guys click save after you guys put the uh, gesture in. Let me do A. Uh, wait, which one my actual Roblox? Okay, so A. Now, I'm gonna do D, uh, except I'm gonna put it right. Um, yeah. Now we want to do uh, S backwards. I'm going to be doing this. All right. Hold up. Let me just do that. All right. Save. Now I'm going to be putting space bar. I think space bar is around somewhere like here maybe. So I'm just going to save that. Now you guys are almost ready to go. What you guys need to do is you guys want to go to recipes. Go back to recipes. Click launch uh, recipe. Now put your recipe Roblox or whatever you named it. Now click that. Now you want to turn on switch, switch control. And yeah, your switch controls are configured to use the Roblox. So now I'm just gonna go down. Uh, I'm gonna launch a game. Let's go to Natural Disaster Survival for this example. And yeah, look now if I uh, see, look, jump uh, works. Now the thing works, as you can see. It's not fully optimized, so therefore, you know, you're gonna like, you know, uh, yeah. So as you can see, it's working right now. Uh, there you go. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe, turn on notifications, like the video, and let me know if you guys want any other tutorials. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Here's another proof that it's working right now. There you go. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There it is.
if you guys want that video, I'll, re I'll record it, I'll upload it, and I'll put it in the YouTube. Um, so, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't subscribe to the link the video, like I already said. And, yeah, 